Hello and welcome. This is the scene here at Molyneux. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Wolverhampton Wanderers up against Leeds United. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Well, for the visitors, Stuart, we're talking about the worst defence in the league. Room for improvement, certainly. Well, I just can't see how they keep a clean sheet today. At times this season, they've been shambolic at the back. The distance between the defenders has been far too big and therefore they're too easy to play against. The initial 11 for Wolves. Joao Moutinho plays alongside Ruben Neves in the centre of midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. And a look at the Leeds United starting 11. Well, although we have it down as a 4-5-1, it's actually more likely to be a 4-2-3-1. They play with two holding midfield players, a number 10 and two wingers. The system has a nice balance to it. And the match is underway. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. Well, there we have it. The first yellow card of the game. And he's going to have to be careful now. There's a long time to go here. Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful. But when he shoots, I expected him to go across the goalkeeper. He should never beat the goalkeeper inside that near post. That's not good keeping. So the ball rolling again with the score line standing at 1-0. Well, he likes to run at them. Can he take advantage? Well, the keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save. It's Wolves' turn now. Johnny has the strength to hang on to it. Not much time to make up his mind. I think you've got to conclude that was good refereeing. A free kick in the end after initially playing advantage, but it just wasn't there. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Ruben Neves. Free kick awarded then by the referee. Well, no problems defensively. Wonderful challenge and a throw in coming up.
Llorente. And Rodrigo has it. Rodrigo. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Ruben Neves. Podence. Jimenez. Not a great challenge. Free kick here. Nuri. Now what can they do from here? And a goal! They've added to the lead. Much needed security. Well, as you can see, he beats the defenders so easily with a change of pace, and then it's a decent finish. That's a very good goal, you have to say. So, 2-0 now. Difficult to stop him. Every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one. Cleef. Dallas here. Harrison. And giving the ball away. Well, as you can see, Wolves have had most of the ball and they've made good use of it. They really have played some good attacking football and they look like scoring more. And a tidy challenge. But it did look dangerous for a moment, but the keeper has it now. Wolves with the ball once more. Good tackle. Wang Hee Chan. It's with Moutinho. Wang Hee Chan. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. There it is! The goals keep coming. No stopping them today. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. So continuing with the action has been all Wolves. And you sense they could meet out additional punishment. Llorente. Well, approaching half time on the home side, very much in charge here, Stuart. Your thoughts? Well, what a first half performance this has been so far. They look like scoring. Oh, every... wait a moment, Stuart. Look at what's happening. And still danger here. But no, the flag is up and it's offside. Rodrigo here's Rafinha and that is how to win the ball back from your opponent oh in with a chance 
has a go. And he's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. Junior Firpo. So there goes the half-time whistle, and the visitors find themselves behind at the break. Well, Derek, we said they'd struggle to defend, and that's been the case again here. They've been all over the place at the back. I couldn't even tell you what their defensive game plan is. This could get embarrassing. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Jimenez. Very quick thinking there. Rodrigo. Has a go! Thwarted by the post. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Well, I'm still amazed that stayed out. He looked to have done everything right, didn't he? No, not the best challenge. Well, in the final analysis, it was good defending. Good bit of pressing. Now what can they do from here? Well, close down straight away. Denied again. And unfortunately for him, he had worked his way into an offside position. And I think everybody in the ground could see that was always going to be offside. Substitution time it is here. Committed challenge. Rodrigo. Possession given away, unfortunately. Tidy in possession. Johnny. And into the last 30 minutes now. It is to be a throw in. And it is substitution time at this juncture, not just from one side, but from both. In the right place to cut out the pass. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Shot attempted. Always going to be the goalkeeper's ball. Read it superbly to take back possession. Neves. And he's in. A goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect. But should the keeper be beaten at his near post? I don't think so. He really needs to do better in those situations. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Rafinha and Rodrigo has it Bamford and with that the attack fizzles out Roman Saiz Nuri
Jimenez. Well, possession is the watchword inside the... Oh, what an opportunity! My goodness, it looked as though he was clean through. And the referee, what will he do here? And it is an early shower for him. Red card. Well, the outcome was never in doubt. That was always going to be a sending off. nonsense clearance and the timing was perfect ball one perfect tackle well he's lost the ball difficult to stop him it needs an accurate cross and space available inside. Oh, fancy footwork. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. So a personnel change then. Can someone get on the end of this? Well, nothing comes of it. Raul Jimenez has eyes for goal. Oh, a good diving save. And there's the delivery. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Can they create something? We wondered who was going to win the race. The answer, the goalkeeper. Raul Jimenez. Well, he could really get at the opposition. Play towards the back post. Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. My goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. And the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Four shot. Now with Bamford. Running with the ball confidently. Well, not making life difficult for the keeper at all. A wide attempt. So the referee blows for full time. And I'll tell you what, not a great day at the office for Leeds United. They've lost the game. What did you make of it? Well, once again, they were all over the place defensively, and I can't see them improving because their tactical understanding and positional play is non-existent. Something has to change quickly.